I think you still have, in the American media in particular, you still have a lot of integrity on the level of the reporters, on the level of the editors and the producers. Unfortunately, what they're allowed to cover, where they're allowed to base themselves as foreign correspondents, or how long they're allowed to spend on a story, uh, depends on what the corporate level media uh, tells them that they can spend. So the news has gotten shallow uh, for the same reason what we were talking about earlier uh, with, with the energy policy. Basically, you have the private sector, uh, who in this case isn't infringing on the public sector, the government sector, but on what should kind of be a third leg of that tripod. You have the private sector, you have the, gov you have the public sector, and then you have the media sector. I hate to say media because that limits it, but basically you should have a section of the population that their job is truth-telling. These are the scientists, uh, these are the journalists, these are the storytellers, uh, and these are the spiritual and religious leaders as well. They should be a separate leg that supports uh, a society separate from government and separate from, from private from money interest. And if you have those three interests together, uh, supporting each other, you have a very solid, stable tripod of balance for a society. Uh, when you let one of those sections overtake the other sections, and in this case, what we're seeing at this point in history is the private sector is kind of overtaking everything, you go from three legs to two legs to one legs, and that's not going to stand.